good afternoon guys uh, welcome to my channel uh, a quick uh, information about the jibao sow slash 20 seems to be pretty powerful by the way this is not wi-fi uh, one otherwise you will get an sow 20 m as an option uh, this is the box i didn't order it online i just picked it up uh, from a local store in Dubai, uh, roughly around $140-$150 in Dubai uh, is this one. I I have not got a great experience of Jibao in past. I was owning the RW15, uh, but it had a problem of rusting as the time uh, went off. It I, I could use it for for close to an year or so and then eventually uh, I saw rust from it once I closed my tank for a while and then I saw both my wave maker completely destroyed uh, the RW15 of Jibao and then and when I noticed it uh, it was completely rusted now I'll tell you what I did with this new piece just to make sure that this doesn't go on the rust route very simple just I used a dollar of putty out here I don't know if you can see it and uh, yeah I have just wrapped it and sealed it completely with putty the black putty not be a great uh, craftsmanship but I think it serves the purpose for me so so I'll tell you where the problem is and and I will urge you guys if you have problem with the uh, J cards uh, rusting then I'll tell you where the problem starts with is this one uh, underneath this is where you get the rust going in and by the way this side is inside the tank and the magnet uh, magnet is on the on the outer side uh, uh, which is outside the tank uh, I have sealed this completely learning from my past experience this complete thing has been is been it's been blocked let me put it in sunlight so that you can view it much clearly i hope you can see it look i have completely sealed it out here i've also sealed the corners um it's a new piece mind you uh, but i had to do it there's no other way and also the screws here i have put putties on the screws as well which are the plastic screws and there was a gapping out there which uh, through which the water could have penetrated so i have I have made sure that I seal those, uh, uh, those uh, seal them uh, permanently so that there isn't any problem. Uh, it's an easy way, guys. It doesn't look good, but then you you have spent money. You want at least run it as long as possible, um, and and you can avoid rusting. Uh, the screws you really cannot tighten the one which are there down here which I showed you, you just can't tighten it uh, easily uh, and and that was the only option with the putty I hope it runs well uh, it's pretty strong I just used it 20 minutes back and in the room temperature this has really become hard now um, so yeah this is good to go so I thought I should share to you guys if you like it please uh, leave your comment I I'm not a guy who, who keeps on putting a lot of videos, but I, I thought this is very useful for you guys and, and uh, see you around. Bye-bye.